Hi, I'm Tyler and I'm the creator of all the visuals you're about to see. I'm a student at Galen Catholic College, Wangaratta, Victoria, and all content in this video was shot at home due to COVID-19. The theme of this video is states matter and how particles react on a different amounts of heat. Anyway, I hope you enjoy the video. Well, in this case, it starts as a solid, but with a little heat, the force of attraction between the ice particles becomes weaker and the particles can move freely. This process is called melting. Then if we add a little more heat to those same particles, the force of attraction decreases to a point where there is no force holding these particles together. The energy from this heat causes the particles to move rapidly. This process is known as evaporation. If we cool down those same particles, they start to gain a force of attraction, then changing them back into liquid form again. This is also known as condensation. Condensation commonly happens when the air around a cool drink turns into water droplets. Then if we cool those particles down once more, it can turn back into a solid due to the high force of attraction. This is known as freezing. During these changes, the particles have not changed in size, only the distance between them. Thanks for watching.